Okay, um, my name is Richard. I'm the CEO of Seed Educational Consult. I want to um, analyze a structure or a sentence using the X bar module. Um, I know that a lot of students out there have issues with analyzing structures and sentences using the X bar module because of its complex complexities. So uh, I want to um, analyze a sentence and perhaps. Uh, teach you how to do it okay uh, with, with this so um, the, the sentence I will be using is is this um, it appears it appears uh, it appears that James is strong okay so I'll be using this okay so you should understand that um, according to, um, according to the to the X-bar module uh, you you start uh, Okay, a sentence like this with the inflection, inflection of phrase, okay? And so the inflection of phrase expands into a specifier and then the I bar, the inflection of bar, okay? While the inflection, the I bar, okay, comes to, I mean, expands, okay, as um, the inflection, okay? And then, um, and then a, a, a VP, okay? So the, the specifier, Okay, which I have written as SPEC is the noun phrase, okay, which um, has become the it here, okay. So um, the inflection, of course, you know, is what assigns um, case to this it. This is an explicit it. I'll talk about this in maybe another video, okay. So, but um, you have the inflection, I, and, um, and um, of course, this is minus past. Because the verb itself is appears, which is in the present form, okay. So the VP expands as the V bar, and then you can have the V itself, which is now appears, okay. But you know that um, uh, that James is strong is a, is a subordinate clause, okay. So this is how we account for subordinate clauses. Do you understand now? So the subordinate clause has a C bar, and then it expands has the complement. But this is called complementizer phrase, okay? So that's a, that's the terminology in um, in um, the X bar module. So you call this a um, um, complementizer phrase, which expands, okay, as the C bar, and then you have the C, which is that, and then um, you have another, of course, IP, okay, which starts from here. James is strong, is you know an independent clause and so you have to account for that even though all of this is also an independent clause so the idea is you've got um, an independent this is you've got a, I mean a sentence all of this is a sentence I mean to say uh, but in this sentence of course you've got independent clauses and um, subordinate clauses so so you must be able to account for that and so you've got the IP and then you go through the same process again where the IP expands as the specifier and the I bar and the now the specifier is the new MP which is James okay and then you have the I which is also minus past because the verb now the verb is is and so this is this is minus past and so um, <clears throat> so you have the I and then you have your VP the VP exp expands as the V bar and then you have your V, okay, which is um, is, and then you have your adjective phrase, and that's um, strong, okay. So um, this is how to analyze the okay, case sentence using the X bar module, okay. Um, so if you have any questions, you can um, um, reach me, okay, at Seed Educational Consult, okay. So um, until until next time, later.